It's a small world we live in, but at a West London studio which specialises in making scale models, you really feel like Gulliver in Lilliput. Trees are made of sponge rubber in this model of the Harlow housing scheme. The model was made at the request of the architect to assist him and the Harlow Corporation in future planning. Authentic to the last detail on a scale of 16 feet to 1 inch, it took 450 hours to construct. Started 20 years ago by Ken McCutcheon, the firm has since reconstructed in miniature many famous projects, including the new London Airport. Larger still is a model to a scale of 200 feet to 1 inch of the Kuwait oil refinery showing tankers in the port of Mina Alamadi. Expert Ralph Whitten needs tweezers to set in position the bridge of a tug only 5 eighths of an inch long and to find a mast from a hog bristle brush. Most men are scared of losing their hair, but for the sake of art, 16-year-old David Austin makes use of his. He finds a strand makes an ideal cable for the tiny but correctly proportioned Derek. A masterpiece of detail, the layout, including the refinery itself, took more than 1,000 hours to complete. In the port, the world's largest tanker, World Glory, made of Perspex, is the center of attraction. Work of historical as well as topic.